you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee in a match. Just so wise. Bruce Lee enters the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC champion. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles. And it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Couple of chins here being tested early. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Early connection with the left from the champ. Oh, very bad of the champ. Straight punch is true. Keep your hands up. Just misses with the left hook. How good is this action about a minute in? I think I'm gassing out just watching this thing. I'm exhausted trying to call <laughs> all the strikes that these two men are throwing at each other. What a fun fight. Yeah, hate to be the punch counter tonight. <laughs> and he connects with the punch there. Relax. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eights. Going to the sidekick. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that lead the dance. Oh, perfect execution on the low kick. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, it's stringing them together so effectively. Never throwing the same attack more than once. What a job to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. Try to establish that jab. Oh, nice. He lands to the body. Connects with a beautiful jab. Until he blocks it. You better keep throwing those body kicks. Big power shot there. All right, so now we start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You gotta think he's gonna continue to attack the body with all of his strikes. Well, his opponent has not done anything to deter him. He should keep doing this, keep going to the well until his opponent finds an answer because right now, he seems lost to it. Under two minutes to go here in round one. Got the single collar tie. Oh, massive knee to the head. Straight right hand, no good. Both fighters throwing heat now. Punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing his shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Lee's kick to the body. That one blocked by the defense. Oh, nice punishing kick to the body. And 
And that left hook landed on the button. Less than a minute to go in the round. Oh, there's that kick, and it lands. Nicely timed kick to the body for the champion. Another powerful kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight. Yeah. For it's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Throwing that jab, no good. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Oh. Second round, straight oh. ahead. All right, a lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. All right, so as this next round gets underway, hopefully the good action we saw in the last round will continue. Both fighters certainly had their ups and downs, both got the offense going, but now we'll see if one fighter or the other can really take control of what has been a very close fight thus far. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Upstairs with the high kicks. Nice job landing the double jab there, DC. I mean, you are definitely pressing that one. You love that one, <laughs> don't you? You love that jab. Oh, beautiful job to get the kick home to the body. Leg kick lands, my favorite strike. Well, the most significant stat in this fight, and you can see it right there in plain sight, bottom of your screen, the body strikes. His opponent has had absolutely no answer. He hasn't lowered his guard with the elbow whatsoever. And I'm not sure how many strikes to the body he can take before he ends up crippling here. We'll see. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure. He has certainly kept up his angle. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Colby Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Better defense, better defense. Get that right hand up. Oh, sidekick. Well done. He's throwing these punches in combination. Really dictates the pace for his opponent. Three minutes to go. Oh, he lands another debilitating strike to the body, and he continues to punish his opponent's midsection. Had a lot of success with it in the previous round and picking up exactly where he left off. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. Collar tie here in the clinch. Oh, timely knee to the body there. Going to the body now with that hook. Well placed there by Lee. Really using his reach advantage to great effect with that punch there. Devastated body kick land. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. Can't take too many more of those. Over and over, this guy's getting hit right in his face. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Still 
Taiwan able to find that precise range with the high kick. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. 90 seconds to go. Oh, beautiful knee to the body by him there. Again, we talked off the top about his size advantage, and he put it to good use there. Look at the control of the posture as they land that knee. And there's a takedown attempt. It's a nice jab by him there. Man, his body not looking too good right now. It's not quite Dominic Reyes against Jan Bohovic, but these body strikes really starting to add up. They're starting to pay dividends. You know, he spoke to us about this earlier in the week, how he was going to eat this guy up from bottom to top. He was going to go in reverse. That is exactly what he has done. Well, one got through. That kick was blocked. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well there. Nice jab by Lee. And they separate after exiting the clinch. Leg kick. Under 20 seconds now to go. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Right hand by the champ, yeah. He gets to the single column tie. Look him drive and move his opponent to find openings to land that free hand. Good round. All right, buddy. Listen, you are winning this fight. I need you to stay doing what you're doing. All right? He's very open to body shots right now. I want you to go out there and I want you to keep... You ready? You ready? Let's do it. Round three of a possible five. All right, pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round gets on. I expect the action to really pick up now. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to approach the end of the fight. Blocks the strike and then counters with a beautifully placed hook. Nice job by Lee. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Oh, that is a nasty inside leg kick, DC. It is a great technique, but it only takes one time to check it. Right. And your night can be over. Or you can end up like Anderson Silva. Be careful. Got an issue? Here's a tissue. Come on, let me see that right Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following the game plan, and it's working. Lee gets caught by that straight punch, beautifully landed by the opposition. Ooh, big shot lands. Great job blocking that shot. Come on, bud. Let's get those hands working now. Oh, the hook lands. Well, new round, same result as he continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous round. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar tie. Man, he's got good hands. Beautiful strike there. Just over three minutes to go. Leading now, nasty cut on his nose. Well, now these kicks are really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Missed with that right hand. Oh, roundhouse kick. Style points on that one. Oh, nice. Well, from a striking standpoint, he has put it all together tonight. He has landed a ton of significant strikes, and 
Pretty easy fight, I would think, for the judges to score. It's a pretty easy fight to score. Tonight was a night where everything went right, and that doesn't happen very often. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands Less up. than Let's two go. minutes to go in round three. <laughs> Leg kick lands nicely done. Yeah, he's got to. He's got to start checking kicks. Taking a lot of body shots as well. Huge knee lands from the close. Nice punch to the head. There's another one. Well, we got a lot of blood now, ladies and gentlemen. I think my mother just turned off the TV. But every time that area gets targeted, that cut is getting worse and closer, theoretically, to the end of the fight. Yeah, and, you know, when you got a person like this in front of you that is so good at what they do, when you are bleeding like this and the work is showing, you got to try to find a way to stop them. He needs to try to get a takedown or something because the more he's standing, the more he's going to have to deal with this cut and now all the blood that's coming from the cut. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Nice combination. Great block there. Really finding the kicking range now. Another one lands there. Oh, two strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. All right, so a little welt there starting to develop on the side of his body. A lot of strikes landing in that area tonight. I mean, he's got to do something. You cannot continue to ignore that you're getting hit in the body over and over again. You better address it now before we get to a point where you can't continue to fight. Huge damage from that elbow. That's three rounds. We're now headed to the championship round. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, so now we have some real adversity. There's a cut on the nose. Hard to know if that's impacting the breathing, but some definite damage in that previous round. Yeah, some real damage. And now when you get a cut like that, that is in a bad spot. Because every time you get hit on the nose, it's so jarring and then the blood starts to go down into the mouth. He's got an uphill battle ahead of him. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. You can feel the tension. Fourth round is underway. We'll see who has the upper hand here. You feel it inside of the arena. The fighters feel it inside of the octagon. It's palpable. The energy is crazy because you understand that in the next 10 minutes, someone's going to get a belt strapped around their waist. It's amazing. Push kick there to the body. He gets in a single collar time. Look for him to now start to find uppercuts up the middle to try to do damage to his opponent. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. All right, so we're starting to see some swelling now, DC. We'll see if he can make some adjustments defensively. He's taking too many of these shots up top. I mean, he's got to move his head right away. He's waiting. He's being reactive. You got to be active in your motions before your opponent sets up their attacks. Oh, you land, I land is how we're doing here. Nice leg kick. He's got that single collar tie locked in. Pretty good series of knees by him there, DC. He told us on Thursday he felt like they would be there. They have been there. They have been there, and he is driving them into his opponent's body. It's hard to watch. Oh, thwack. That is a solid kick right there. Right on the button. Ooh. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right
right there, his opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. Beautiful shot lands to the leg there. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Oh, right hand. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. He's going after the head. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Lee going for the body, missed with that kick. And doing work with the jab. Under two minutes here to go round four. Massive knee lands from the tight punch. Nice body kick. Oh, and there's a kick to the body, not having that one blocked by Lee. Oh, almost like he saw the skin swell right away after he landed that strike. So that trainer's gonna have to bring in the end swell to try to deal with the swelling, because this guy is getting pieced up. Lance, a good series of kicks here. True there by Lee. Get behind that Back and forth we go. Well, as soon as he goes with that high guard, he pays for it to the body. You see the bruises really starting to accumulate. In the beginning of the fight, you think, I gotta protect my head at all costs. Right now, I believe that this guy has to worry about his body. Look at how red the side of his body is, he has got to change something. 45 seconds remain in the round. Strike lands cleanly there. Oh, that's a heavy kick downstairs. Nice block. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, Superman punch is good. Final seconds of the round. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Huh. 20 down, five to go. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Fifth and final round, fourth coming. All right, so here we go with our next round. DC, you are known for having one of the higher fight IQs in the game, and I would put him on that list after what we saw in terms of the body work there in the previous round. He did a fantastic job of mixing up his target, not headhunting, going to the body, making that investment into forcing a mistake later that will allow him to chase his finish. Great job landing that body kick. Again, that body kick, that body kick is going to really take effect on him. And it won't take very long. Oh, beautiful job getting the foot to the head there. Oh, huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Oh! A swing and a miss by Lee. 
straight punch. Useful. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Back and forth we go. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Now lands a kick to the body. So he earned respect from his opponent early on with the power, and now the swelling really started to become a factor, champ. The swelling starting to become a factor. This guy is so good at recognizing a weakness in his opponent. He got him hurt, he got him swollen a little bit, and now it's starting to pay dividends. He's got to find a way to finish his fight. Well, you know, Rogan's pissed he missed this one. We are witnessing an instant classic. Back and forth we go. Both fighters have been on the cusp of being finished, and both have exuded a ton of heart. Yeah, they've both shown heart, courage, ability, technical skills. I can't really tell you how these two are still in the fight. With oh, picture perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, big left hook there. Keep your hands up. Keep your hands up. Oh, nice body shot. Two minutes now to go on the fight. Well, no surprise, he goes for the takedown there, unable to get the fight to the canvas. This is a testament to his opponent, his ability to see the shots coming, defend them, and make the fight happen where he wants to. Well, when you're dealing with a cut like that, it may not be long before it starts to impact the breathing. Not a good spot to be in here. Oh, nice kick. is blocked, no damage there. You know, a lot of people say those don't land, but even if you're blocking them a little bit, they still put damage on you. Straight right hand now, just misses. You know, I gotta tell you, I'm not sure that his face could be much more swollen at this point in time. You gotta raise that guard. You gotta get the high guard. I mean, at this point, John, you gotta forget everything else and get the guard up high, keep your elbows in tight, and try to make sure that nothing lands clean on your face, because every time, you're gonna just get more and more swollen. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Can't take many of those, you better check. Oh man, that cut is getting worse, absolutely nasty. Heavy leather landed on both sides in that exchange. What a beautiful body kick. Over and over and over. He's landing these nasty body kicks. Big inside kick. Waning seconds of this fight. the final horn. What a tremendous finish to this one as we go the full 25 minutes. The Ladies official and decision is in. It resides rounds, with Bruce Buck. We go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50-45. The winner by unanimous decision and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world Bruce the Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and give it